Good morning, y'all. Happy Friday. Happy first day of the vlog. Day of the vlog. I'm still trying to not talk super normal because I still have stitches in my mouth from last week's vlog dental procedure. I'll link it down below or I'll list. Yeah, I'll link it down below if you want to watch it. Cash and I are going to go for a little ride. So yesterday I, I can't really eat solid foods yet. I'm getting there slowly. So yesterday I went to this little local I don't know if it's local this little spot and ordered some grits and they were so good so i'm gonna go get some more today my face looks good though this side is pretty much normal this side right here is a little bit swollen too i talked to the doctor yesterday just to make sure everything was going as planned and it is it's just that one side it's just taking a little bit longer for the swelling to go down but i feel good again i have no pain I said that last week, same this week, no pain. It's just a little bit sore and I've just got to take it easy eating and things like that. So welcome to this week's vlog. Say hi. No, you don't, you don't know. <laughs> okay, y'all, uh, breakfast first. And then today is just another relaxing day. I'm not doing anything that's on the, well, I did work out this morning to be fair, a very light workout. All right. As you heard yesterday, I had one and I could have eaten 17. So we're going to do two today. I'm just going to put them in a bowl, add some salt and pepper. Cash is drinking water in the background. They just slap on a slice of American cheese. Mm hmm. Mm. I'm also going to make me a coffee. I need to drink this water. So I'm going to leave it out. I need to take some ibuprofen to help with the swelling though it looks pretty good and then this is the plan i'm gonna sit on the couch alternate heat and ice and this is me for the day so i'm i did lay out some ground beef last night to cook and didn't end up cooking it so i'll probably cook it for lunch today so when i do that i will show you because i'm not doing anything else so i feel like that would be pretty Fun to watch. And welcome to lunchtime. So it's almost. I think it's almost one. I feel like I just looked at that. So, what are the chances that you think I can eat this frozen pepperoni pizza? I'm starving. I'm so hungry that I feel nauseous. So, like, I feel like my legs are shaking. So, I'm gonna cook the pizza for 25, 10 to 12 minutes. And in the mean time, I need a snack. I wonder if these are still good. 16th. Pizza is done. So I think my best bet is to probably just eat the top and not the crust because it's hard. So that's what I'm gonna do. Did a little bit of a grocery delivery some dog food i needed some cat treats i got some diet coke are you interested she just knocked that bag of treats over these are not for you this is for cash this is for cash Good morning, y'all. Happy Saturday. So I did a workout this morning. It was good. I was gonna film the other way, so I turned on all these lights. I'm just gonna turn them off because we're not doing that. So workout went good. Oh, my eyes are, I sat in the shower for a long time. It felt so nice. It was so cold this morning. I think it said 52 in my garage, which granted we do have heaters and stuff like that. So um, Carly used a heater. I did not because, you know, I was working out. And I was already going to sweat. So today's plan, I'm going to open this window, <laughs> these blinds so that Cash or Layla can sit in the window. I'm going to make me some breakfast. I still have stitches in my mouth. They are supposed to come out any day now. So I was actually on tap. I know I mentioned in my last vlog that on Saturday, which is today, I was, I scheduled myself for work. I don't think... Like when I smile, you can see the stitches and this side's still a little bit swollen. So I smile funny. So I think what I'm going to do, I have a couple of reels that I want to shoot and maybe some pictures so we can do all that stuff. But as far as like the talking, like YouTube videos, 
You okay? As far as the talking YouTube videos, we're gonna wait because y'all know I talk and smile a lot in those videos and I just, it doesn't look right, right now. And I also don't wanna mess it up and smile too much. And as far as pictures, I can sort of get away with looking away or looking down. Or, you know what I mean? We can work that out. Plus, there's a market, like a Christmas market in Sims today, the town that my mom lives in. And they're lighting the Christmas tree, like doing all this really fun stuff. And I want to go there and take some pictures and also shop while I'm there. And it won't be there tomorrow, so we're going to do that today. And for those of you who actually want to see my smile, see, it's like a little bit weird on this side. And you can see the stitches. I've moved to sitting outside. It's now like 12.15. I obviously got ready. Um, I filmed a couple things and then I realized that my face doesn't, like I don't smile the same. <sighs> so I think I'm going to pause filming those. One of them is a Shein Reel, which is already up by now. I think it's fine. It looks cute. It's like a more not so playful reel. I mean, you know what I mean? Like I just didn't smile a lot. So I think that one will be okay. But I'm also doing five days of my favorite PJs. <laughs> like a real, I haven't seen anyone do it. And I thought that it would be fun since y'all know I love my matching pajamas and I have some new ones in. And so I thought we could do that. Um, so I'm gonna have to just film that one a little bit later because again, my face is not quite there yet. Plus I'm going out of town next week. Uh, actually the day after you're watching this and I thought it would be fun to do one of the pajama reels in a hotel room. I mean, look at this. Don't look at the door <laughs> to the shed back there. I, we have not been in that shed in years. Every like other year, Brian throws a bug bomb in there cause he says he's going to clean it out and he hasn't yet. So I'm not going in there, but it's just such a pretty, like look how nice the pool looks. Okay. We've made it. Do you want to be in the video? I do. Say hi. Oh, hi. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna show you what it looks like. Look at those cute green chairs. I guess maybe they're gonna do something tonight. All right, so we've got food trucks here. The market or the little, yeah, it's called the Sims Market. The market there. And this is where we're going, the Christmas tree. We're gonna find the side right there in the shade and then we're gonna walk around. Okay, picture secured. So now we're just gonna shop around. Look at those bells. Oh, you wanted books like that. Hey, how are you? Look at those that say, oh, holy night. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's wood blocks, but it looks like books. Oh, it sure does. Oh, there's a bunch, yeah. That's cute. I guess they make furniture. It's a rocking chair. Oh, look at that pillow. That's cute. I'm gonna take her picture in front of this sign. We gotta get closer. Okay, I'm gonna take a picture. Pictures turned out so cute. Okay, my mom's getting her a hot dog. So I'm gonna drive and see if I can meet her to pick her up because it's a little bit of a trick for her. So I'm gonna meet her around the corner. Our next stop is Sims Heritage Park. It's this really pretty white, like a little church. Is that what it is? Schoolhouse. Yeah. Original 1902 one room schoolhouse. That? Oh, that's this, she says. And then, the and then this is, oh, it's a chapel. Malone Chapel and Museum, established in 2000. So this is a spot that we've come to several times to take pictures, so. That's the first schoolhouse in Sims. This one right here? Mm -hmm. It's got a little plaque on the front too. Quick change -a in the car, <laughs> per usual, into my next outfit. Third outfit change. How you feeling? Good, good, good. You're feeling good. Yes, so this one should be pretty in this spot. This is the spot with the red wagon. This could also be an option here. And just like that, I'm home with the dog. Successful day of shooting. I'm very, very happy with the photos. So I'm excited to share those once those roll around. You'll see them on Instagram. That's what we did today as well for Instagram. Happy Monday, y'all. It is kind of late in the afternoon. I want to say it's like 3, 3.30, 3.35. So Brian and I are going to decorate for Christmas. He's putting the fall decor, the minimal decor that we put out. I think there was like three pumpkins put out. He's putting those back in the totes that we pulled down and never emptied. We're going to put them back in the attic, pull out the Christmas decor, and decorate. I just got home from the dentist. I 
just asked him to check everything, make sure it was fine. Everything is fine. He actually took the stitches out, most of the stitches out with the exception of a couple right there. So I'm happy. Everything looks like it's supposed to look for the most part. And I just feel so much better after seeing him. We've already hit a snafu. Lights are out in the middle. So therefore this one won't light up either. So Brian just left to go to Walmart to try to get whatever he needs to fix it. In the meantime, I did put the tree up in my room. Not doing too good so far. Maybe I'll plug in these trees right here that we got from Costco. Insert three C batteries not included into each compartment with the proper, okay, closed battery compartment. Are we sure it's three C batteries? These seem a little bit big. Where did I just put the instructions? And this is the, hi, this is the smaller one. Okay, moment of truth. <gasps> there we go. And you can actually set timers on them. <gasps> and here we go. Okay, I like them. I like them a lot. I'm very happy. I kind of wish like I have this little table but I don't trust putting them on the table because of these two. Break time for some dinner. We have these two white and four cheese. So we're gonna make these for dinner. Hi y'all, welcome to Tuesday. Tuesday today is a very busy day for me. Um, so first let's backtrack. As far as Christmas decorations, we didn't do anything else. We ate pizza last night and then watched TV, the lights, and the like top middle section and the whole top section are out. Brian tried for hours, you know, like finding the light that was out and like doing all these things. We do have lights that we can put on there. So I may try to do that today while he's at work because he was very frustrated yesterday. If it'll make him feel better, then I may try to do that. Um, but for today, I woke up at 5.45 this morning and did my workout and now, oh, and then I went to a doctor's appointment. So I just, I uh, wanted a second opinion on something. Plus, I wanted to find me a new doctor. So, we did that. And then, now I'm heading to a hair appointment. I have nine minutes to get there. Which, luckily, uh, Nikki, who does my hair, opened her own salon. So, I'll show you when we get there. It's the cutest. She had someone, like, design the inside of it. It's so cute. So, I'll show you again when we get there. But, luckily, it's not as far as the other one. So I can probably get there in for sure less than 10 minutes. And then at 3 p.m. I'm getting my nails done. I'm getting a fun design. There's animal print involved. So that's the plan for today. Teeth feel so much better. Again, stitches are gone on this side underneath. It's hanging on literally by a thread. And then this side, there's just one little stitch at the top, which you really can't even see that much, which is good because again, I have something on Friday. You can kind of see it right there. Anyway, okay. I feel like I've been running around with a, like a chicken with his head cut off. I'll see you at the hair salon. Okay, here we are. How cute, say hello. I was telling them earlier that it was like such a cute little setup. It's my first time in though. So I just wanted to see it in person. So she's got the chair set up, the wash bowl, all her products and everything. So cute. Who, tell me who designed it for you. My friend Bridget. Your friend Bridget, yes. okay. Uh, so I saw it on Instagram that you had like tagged her and stuff, so. She's a real estate agent, but she's very talented. Yeah. <laughs> so anyway, here it is, super cute. I just wanted to show y'all, I love that too. Okay, and we're done. She's super quick, it's only 12.15. We did a couple of, or a little bit of low lights too to just help the root blend a little bit more i did buy some product it is so cute in there on the way out i was a little bit distracted on the way in like following her but on the way out i was able to like peek into a couple other little rooms and they are so cute so i'm very happy we did a partial highlight again with a bit of a darker she always does such a great job okay so here's the plan while i was in there i was perusing 
on Michael's website and they have Christmas trees that are 50% off. Today is the last day and they have like seven foot, seven and a half foot trees. There was a seven and a half foot tree in stock, I checked at this store or nearby for like $1.99 and, and another one was like $2.15, $2.14.99, something like that. That was the 50% off price. I'm not, I was gonna go ahead and buy one online so that I could secure it and just run and pick it up. But there's so many different kinds of branches. Like I, I can't even, I don't know the difference. So I'm gonna run in and look since I have time before my next appointment. So here we go. I want, okay, seven foot pre-lit, but I don't want the colored lights. Ooh, look at that frosted or flocked is what they call it. My cat would eat that. Okay, so we, we can't do that. I like this style versus this style of branch. I think this is the one I was looking at online. One ninety nine, seven and a half foot. It's a little bit open, you know what I mean? So let's go look at the one around the corner. Ooh, I like this one. Yes, seven and a half foot Jasper Cashmere, two fourteen ninety nine. Okay. Look, oh, they're temporarily out of stock. You think they'll give me this one? <laughs> Probably not. Okay. Seven foot pre-lit willow pine. Uh, that one's okay. So this is the one that I wanted. Out of stock, I just bought it online. And it says that shipping is like November 26th through the 30th. Today's the 23rd. So hopefully it'll, it will arrive promptly as it says. But I liked these different bristles ends branches and it does have some regular ones mixed in there too it's full i like it i'm interjecting i'm editing this vlog right now actually i was looking at michael's website today so the day that i bought the tree was yesterday on tuesday today is wednesday and that tree is actually marked down even more to 169.99 so I called Michaels, the corporate like 1-800-MICHAELS number, and they refunded me the difference. So they gave me the sale price. My tree still shipped and everything on time, but they refunded me that difference. So that was very nice. I just want to tell you because the deals are going to be crazy, probably even better the day you're watching this and on Black Friday, but I did get it for even cheaper. Okay, came home, let the dog out, ate lunch, pulled my hair back, going to get my nails done. So this is what they look like now. I haven't gotten them done since, it's been a couple weeks, but I told y'all that Carly, my trainer, found um, a nail lady in town that's phenomenal. So I'm getting a design today. So we're gonna get rid of this nudie neutral color. The design won't last long though. It's like a very fall look. So I'm gonna do it for probably, I think I go back next Wednesday to get them changed. But anyway, here's the before. And we're done. It's almost five o'clock. It's getting dark outside. I don't think you're ready for this. Oh my gosh. So we've got leopard sparkle, that same nude neutral color I had before. This really pretty design. And then this color, the thumb color is the most gorgeous. It almost matches my shirt actually. I'm, I don't even know what to say. Look at the D, I hope you can see. Let me get my face out of it. The detail. No, you can't see. Hold on. There we go. Look at the detail on that with the leopard print. <gasps> Y'all, I'm obsessed. Such a good job. Seriously, y'all? I am, I don't even know what to say. You know how long I've searched for someone in town? I even drove to another state just to find someone that does incredible nails and she does such a great job. I went ahead and booked my next, my next appointment, my next three appointments, cause she books up so fast. So the next one, I won't do anything design wise. I'm just gonna get a flat color, like a, a basic color. But then the next time I have a really fun Christmas one that I wanna get for that like couple weeks leading into Christmas. I just, I can't, I don't even know what to say such a good job 
such a good job. Okay, I'm gonna end the vlog here. I know it's only Tuesday, but I have so much work to do tomorrow. So I'm gonna go home and go ahead and edit you today. Also, Christmas uh, decorating was a fail. I understand that, but I did buy a new tree. We saw that today. So once that comes in, then obviously I'll show you and we'll decorate together. But anyway, if you like this video, thumbs up, subscribe if you're watching and you're not subscribed already. And I hope you had a good time. I feel like we did some fun things this week. So I'll see you in my next one. Bye y'all.